think Charlie needs a little brush. <laughs> I think I need to fix this bow. <laughs> I think Marshall needs a new bow as well. <laughs> <laughs> Hello and welcome to The, the Magic, Magic Hat. Hat. What have you been doing today? We're sorting out the toys, seeing which ones need cleaning and some need repairing. I wonder what the Magic Hat has in store for us today. Animals. An adventure. Painting. <laughs> oh, it's the Magic Hat. <laughs> Let's see what's in the Magic Hat. It's a song. Well, we're all busy with the toys. How about hmm. Mimi? Great. Well, are you ready? Let's see what the song is. Hello. Today I'm going to be singing to you about a worm called Wiggly Woo. Are you ready? There's a worm at the bottom of the garden and his name is Wiggly Woo. There's a worm at the bottom of the garden And all that he could do Is wiggle all night and wiggle all day The people all around they always say There's a worm at the bottom of the garden And his name is Wiggly Woo There's a spider at the bottom of the garden And her name is Creepy Crawly there's a spider at the bottom of the garden I hope she won't get me She creepies all day and creepies all night She gives everyone a terrible fright There's a spider at the bottom of the garden And her name is Creepy Crawly Now I've sung that for you Get your worms ready and try and join in with me Are you ready? There's a worm at the bottom of the garden and his name is Wiggly Woo. There's a worm at the bottom of the garden and all that he could do is wiggle all night and wiggle all day. The people all around they always say there's a worm at the bottom of the garden and his name is Wiggly, oh so wriggly, Wiggly 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 Woo. Thank you, Mimi. Wasn't it lovely? That was a great song. <laughs> I really enjoyed it. Mm. We have our wiggly worms too. <laughs> what did you think? Did you join in at home? If you didn't, then perhaps you can join in next time. And while Mimi was singing, we managed to do a few jobs. I fixed Nala's bow. I gave Charlie a brush and cleaned his feet. And I think Marshall looks a lot happier. <laughs> Let's see what the magic hat has in store for us now. I think that's a pig. So I don't know, maybe we're going mm. to a farm? Let's see. Hello there. Today the magic hat has sent me somewhere very exciting. I'm at a place where there's lots of animals to see and loads of fun to be had. That's right, I'm at Woodside Farm to have a look at all the animals that live here. Today we're going to have a look at the pigs, the lambs, and if we're lucky, maybe the llamas will come out to play. So come along with me and let's have a look at all the animals. Wow, there's so many animals here. They're all so cute, aren't they? Can you guess what animal this is? That's right, it's an alpaca enjoying this nice day out. It's feeding time and it looks like the pigs are hungry. <laughs> well, they certainly are gobbling up their food. Let's go see what the other animals are eating today. My time here at Woodside is almost up, but there's still one more animal to see. <laughs> They're so cute. 
Well, sadly, that's all we have time for today at the farm. I had a fantastic day seeing all the animals, so be sure to join me again soon. Bye. <laughs> that looked like so much fun with all those wonderful animals. Did you know all their names? And did you spot the alpaca? It's another name for a llama. Wow, I didn't know that. We have our own animal right here. We're going to meet Sydney the hamster to find out what it's like having a pet. All the lovely animals at the farm. You just want to cuddle them and hold them in your arms. But today we have a special friend here to play and will hopefully brighten up your day. Let's say a big warm hello to Sydney. Now boys and girls, Sydney is a boy and a girl's name. So Laura, tell us, is Sydney a boy or a girl? Uh, Sydney's a boy. Oh, and how old is he? Um, about six months now, I think. And when's Sydney's birthday? Christmas Day, I always say. Oh, so he's a little Christmas guinea pig. Hamster. <laughs> yeah, hamster. So tell us, Laura, does Sydney like to eat, sleep, or play? He sleeps during the day a lot of the time, and he wakes up uh, during the night and usually wakes me up as well. Um, but yeah, he does like to play in his ball as well. Do you want to show the children how he plays? Yeah. Okay, you can open that for us. Yeah. We go all over the place. <laughs> and so when Sydney likes to eat, and he's a good boy, mm -hmm. does he get any treats? He does, yeah. He's got um, this... Um, is a bar, a treat bar, uh, that hangs on his cage. Okay. Um, and he can nibble at that. And then he also there's little bites as Which well. are made out of fruits, which are good for you, of course. Yes. So Very good for him. All right, then. So while we leave Sydney to play, let's say a big thank you to Laura for bringing mm. in our furry friend to play today. I hope to see you next time with some more adorable animals. Bye. Oh, Sydney was so lovely and cute. <laughs> yes, he was. A handful of furry fun. <laughs> While you were looking at Sydney, we started cleaning brushes. It can get so incredibly messy. Mine's very messy. Mm. It sounds like the magic hat. Another adventure in store for us. Hmm. Well, it looks like paint. And lots of colour. I think we might get a bit messy here. I guess it's painting. Thank <laughs> you. 